I am leaving tomorrow morning and it's just kicking in and I've got this like fury of excitement. Just when you travel, especially when you travel alone, you like sink into yourself. I'm just sort of enjoying this awesome feeling of independence right now. Oh my gosh, I apply for duty free. Starbucks always has insane lines at airports. Dumb. I only slept like three hours last night, but I'm so excited right now. I think I might just get some Starbucks coffee. Horrible idea. This is how they get you. Now I have to have a Starbucks. Oh my god, what do I do? What is your favorite place you've ever been to? Well, I have several. If you want majestic grandeur, I suggest the Andes. Okay. Mmm, whipped cream. It's totally melted. If you want beautiful tropical paradise, I suggest the Seychelles. Delhi, India. The landscape, I love the people, I love their clothes, their jewelry, their food, their music. I love Costa Rica. I haven't been, but I want to go to food. Fiji. <laughs> I've never been to any of those places. What a challenge. <laughs> so it's morning time now. You can tell because they're serving coffee and tea. The only exceptions to my gluten free cup when traveling. Can't always help it. Really good. What is your favorite thing about flying? Honestly, it is meeting people. It is different yeah, people is. from all walks of life. She's listening to paparazzi. It's pretty awesome. That's what I do love about it. It is the diversity of the people that we meet and take care of and listen to them and all their experiences is brilliant having fun and going out and going to the beach or if you go to wherever you travel to you could go out and experience you know the country so I wouldn't do any other job with that. True. That's the awesome. lifestyle is awesome. It is. We're here in Tokyo. <clears throat> I'm connecting to my Bangkok flight. Okay first of all notice the crunky. Oh Japan. Oh, this is what they had. It's this wafer thing filled with ice cream. I was on an airplane in Japan on my way to Thailand with my friend Erica in 8th grade and she was totally passed out. The flight attendant handed me this cold wafer looking thing but I tried it and I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. So, put it right up by her face and nudged her awake I'm like, take a bite of this. <laughs> She's like, gets this huge, amazing, excited face on and sits all the way up, what is that? And she told me afterward that she thought it was soap. I was like, why would you take a bite of it if you thought I was giving you soap? Now they're inventing machines, I guess. Pretty cool. I'm heading to Thailand, well, Chiang Mai and Tokyo. It's interesting. Tokyo's interesting. Chiang Mai is, is beautiful, it's amazing. You've got to go on a, on a raft down a river and on the elephant ride. I used to be able to go in there. My dad had gold member stuff and I would always travel alone and they let me in the lounge. Oh my god, it was amazing. Glorious lounge, everyone's relaxing, awesome Japanese candy and food and everything you can possibly want. One time Erica and I both stopped there. We're coming from Hawaii dressed in like neon colors, eighth graders wear when we're hanging out. We don't really know what we're doing, but we're going to Thailand. Business people, quiet, reading magazines. And I made her laugh so hard she spewed. <laughs> it spews like out onto the ground, out of her nose, and snot came out with it. Uh, so it was pretty amazing making a ruckus in the business class area. While I'm in Thailand, I'm expecting to ride on elephants. I want to go to the market, go to the mall. The food, Chiang Mai, in their street vendors was the best food I've ever eaten. I want to photograph all of the food that I eat and the drinks that I drink. And I'll take the temples too. One thing I would do down there, and that is get a massage every day. Yes, they're so cheap. And is that a challenge? Because <laughs> I will take you up on that. Yeah. And if there's anything that you want to see or do that I haven't thought of or I'm not sure of, let me know. But hopefully you like this stuff, and see you guys later.